everybody, we've got some walking exercises to do today to keep you moving. Take a break from your desk, take a break from the couch. We're going to start with the high knees march, side bends, etc, etc. So do as many as you can, as quickly as you can. Ready? Let's go. High knees. So you can choose to run on the spot if you like. Nice and quick. Really work those arms as well, so give them a good swing. This is something you can do outside as well if you're walking around the block. And much. And if you've been on our socials, you would have noticed that there's a kid's version of this, basically the same, with my kid doing it with me. Nice and high. The more you work those arms, the more you work those knees. Keep going. Don't forget to breathe. Bring this in. Three, two, one. And break. Into the side bends. You're going to bend to the side, really switching on those obliques and sucking your stomach one side to the other. Off you go, to the left. Bend, and bend. That's it. The more you work through here and concentrate and tighten that belt a little bit, the more of a workout you're going to get. Keep going. The nice, quick, little sets. And obviously you want to do more than one set for the full exercise. If you do about four to six to eight, that would be ideal. You'll get a good sweater. Two, one, and break. The next one's the side steps. We're stepping off to the left again. Step, clap, return, clap, return. Let's go. Bend that knee that you're reaching into. You can do this with weights as well. So small one kilo weights is usually pretty good because it does work your upper arms a lot. It's one of those misleading exercises where you go, hmm, that looks pretty easy. Third, fourth round into it, whew, it's pretty hot. Five more seconds. Two, one, finish off. And then we've got squats. We've done this before heaps of times. Get your feet nice and wide. You're gonna sit your bum back and raise your arms about. That's it. Press into the ground, just stand up straight. As you do so, you wanna make sure that you're squeezing your butt and your abdominals, so pull up, reach up. That's it. Arms forward for balance. Making sure that your knees aren't falling inwards as you do this. Let them track over your feet. And making sure your abs aren't relaxing as you go down. Feel those glutes firing. Five more seconds. Last one. Break. Elbows to knees. Really get those obliques working. Suck it in. We're going to reach our knees up towards our elbows. Ready? Off you go. Bring it nice and high. So you can go forward like this as well, or you can go a bit more abducted. Get more glutes working. Suck it in. Breathe. toys already but I did box the other day that's it last five seconds keep it up nice steady rhythm two one and break for the last one we've got punch with twist really rotating across the body look where your fist is going rotate that back leg off you go you want to protect your ankle Knee and hip, so make sure you rotate. Follow that line up toward the fist. Again, you can use a weight in your hands, or you can hold a resistance band between your hands, and as you punch, you've got that resistance to punch against. Lots of upper body work when you do this with resistance. Keep going. Almost there. 
two, one, and break. All right, I hope you enjoy that. Remember, do at least four sets to get a good workout, and I'll see you next time. Bye.